Ever wonder what might happen if we chucked our rubbish into a fiery volcano? Well, let's delve into that thought. Volcanoes, as you may know, are incredibly hot. They're natural furnaces, with temperatures in their magma reaching up to 2,000 degrees Fahrenheit. To put that into perspective, that's hot enough to melt steel. So imagine utilizing this natural heat capacity to incinerate our trash. In a world where waste disposal is a mounting problem, this concept might sound like a brilliant solution. Toss in our garbage, let the volcano do its thing, and voila, no more trash. But how would this work? Simply put, the intense heat would break down the waste materials, reducing them to their basic elements. This process known as pyrolysis could potentially eliminate the need for landfill sites and reduce our environmental footprint. So, in theory, volcanoes could be nature's own trash incinerators, but wait! Before you start lobbing your garbage bags into your nearest lava pit, let's look at the practicality. Scene script. Imagine the scene, mountains of trash tumbling into molten lava. But what about the aftermath? Burning trash in volcanoes might sound like a fiery solution to our waste problems, but it's not without its environmental consequences. You see, not all trash is created equal. Some materials, like plastics and metals, release harmful gases when burned. These gases, including dioxins, furans, and mercury, are notorious for their adverse effects on human health and the environment. Moreover, the air pollution caused by these emissions could significantly impact the local ecosystem. Imagine the once clear skies clouded with smoke and ash, or the pristine air now laden with pollutants. This could lead to a domino effect, disrupting wildlife habitats and potentially causing harm to local species. So, while it's tempting to see volcanoes as nature's incinerators, we must also consider the broader ecological implications. So, it seems that our volcano trash disposal idea might not be so eco-friendly after all. But what about the logistics? So, you've got your trash bag and you're ready for a hike up the volcano. But hold on, let's think about the logistics of this for a moment. Firstly, active volcanoes are not conveniently located in our backyards. They're often in remote, hard-to-reach areas. Imagine hauling tons of trash across vast distances through rough terrains and then up a volcano. Sounds like quite the workout, doesn't it? And then there's the little matter of the risks involved. Volcanoes are, well, volatile. They can erupt at any time, and I don't know about you, but being near a volcano when it decides to blow doesn't sound like my idea of a fun day out. There's also the potential of the trash triggering an eruption. Now that's a garbage day disaster movie waiting to happen. So, while it might make for a thrilling garbage day adventure, it seems that dumping our trash in volcanoes might not be the most practical or the safest idea. To sum it up, while it might be a hot idea, using volcanoes as trash cans is a bit of a meltdown. We've delved into the environmental impacts, the logistical hurdles, and the potential risks. Tossing our waste into the fiery depths of a volcano might sound like a quick fix, but remember, it's not just about the heat, it's about the fallout. So instead, let's emphasize on reducing, reusing, and recycling. Because when it comes to trash disposal, it seems that volcanoes just aren't all they're cracked up to be.